South Africa's world stars joins us in studio today. Lance Isaacs was a South African play, plying his trade as a rider for the iconic Ducati race team in the World Superbike Series in recent years. He also spent nearly four years racing in the United States for Yamaha and Honda in the AMA Superbike Series there. Now, Lance Isaacs, not Armstrong, is with us this morning. Morning, Lance. How are you doing, Evan? I'm always good, Lance. Always good. You know, if we've got to live in a great country and I have a great life. But what's <laughs> happening in your life? Yeah, um, obviously, uh, still applying my trade in the, in the motorsport uh, fraternity. I've had a, a very decent uh, and illustrious career in, in uh, motorcycle racing. I've been very blessed and very fortunate uh, to... Been, I've been blessed with the, with the talent to, to, to um, travel around the world uh, racing motorcycles. And at the moment, I'm riding for BMW South Africa under the uh, Black Swan Energy BMW Motorrad uh, race team. We'll talk about that now, but first I want to talk about the politics. You know, I'm always into the politics, Lance. <laughs> Where are we in motors, motorbike racing in South Africa? Are, are we, have we gone past the glory days? Are we, are we battling a little bit or are better days ahead of us? Um, I'm, pretty, I'm pretty hopeful that, the, that there are better days to come. Um, you know, like anything with, with sports, uh, it's, a, it's, it's financial. Yes. So um, as far as as far as companies putting money behind the sport, you know the sport really hasn't been getting the exposure that it deserves. Um, but there are a few guys that are that are trying to that are trying to do a, a good deed and uh, who are actually trying to make make a difference and and and, and bring the, the the level not the level of the level of the sport has always been yeah. absolutely at, at the top. Yeah. But um, we we trying to get the the exposure levels up back, to where it should back be. Back up there. Well, that's what we're doing. This picture. Just tell us about these shots. The fear factor of being on a bike flat out, Lance. Well, that's pretty much me at the at my desk. <laughs> <laughs> like me at this desk. Yeah, exactly. Okay. You know, it's, uh, I'm at home at uh, at my desk, and this is obviously. Yeah, you're, I'm you're, well you're, at home. You're, I'm you're, well, you're very well at home. I'm well at so, home. Yeah. Yeah, no, I mean, that, that's, that's, a, that's a little glimpse into how much hard work goes into riding a, yeah. a BMW S1000RR. So, um, yeah, over, over 200 horsepower. We're doing over 300 kilometers an hour at, uh, at certain racetracks. People tracks don't realize how, how fit you are. But I want to take you back to, to probably the best years in your life when you were living in Remini and you were racing for the Ducati team back in, in Italy. Yeah. That must have been an absolute treat. Yeah, like you know, like I said, you know, I was very, very fortunate uh, to have competed in the in the World Superbike Championship at a at a very young age. Um, it was definitely one of the experiences of my of my life. Uh, no one can take that away from me. I, I've I've uh, made bonds with with people all over the world, and yeah. uh, you know, I've, I've I've been. But that Ducati was a dog, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, look, you know what? It was at at that level, and and and. Where, where I entered the World Superbike Championship, I think it was probably one of one of the most difficult eras and and most comp competitive eras of, of World Superbike at yeah. the time. And uh, you know what? It, it's it's just uh, it's it's put me on the level that I am today. And at the tender age of uh, 36, being a veteran in South Africa, I, I wanted to <laughs> I wanted to talk to you about that in conclusion because you know at 36. Uh, most people's career are sort of coming to an end. Yeah. Now, you don't ha hang around as long as you have without having spectacular talent, commitment, and, and all the things that do it. When you look back at it, the setbacks, the things that you've had to deal with, how do you view that? Well, you know what, you know, they're all, all the setbacks I view as, I don't, I don't want to call them setbacks, you know, they were, they were, they were stepping stones, obviously, yeah. cliche, you know. Um, you know, they, they obviously have set me up for for where I am today. And I actually think I'm a much better rider now than I was when I actually entered, entered the World Championship. And if I could go back and do things differently, I, w I would. Um, I'd, I'd definitely surround myself with, with a few more mentors uh, yeah. uh, that, I, that I should have had at, at, at that tender age. But uh, you know what? I'm, I'm trying to make a difference now. And, and you know, I think the next phase in my life is actually mentoring uh, youngsters and, and uh, bringing them up in uh, within the sport and, and you know making sure that that uh, they have got the level of support that I wish I had when I entered. 
the, the, the world fray scene. back in. It was a difficult time in South Africa, I think. It also, in, in superbike racing, uh, the, the sport was at times, I think, a little bit dear Makar itself. Yeah. It was a tough time for you. But Lance, yeah. you've, done a fin you've had a fantastic career. Oh, absolutely. Uh, you know, you are, your world name, your household name here in South Africa. And, and thank you for joining us today. And, and all the best with the future endeavors. Let's hope that you can unearth the next Lance Isaacs. Absolutely. Thank you very much. And, you know, it's, we can't do this without uh, any of our sponsors. So, you know, that's, those, are the, those are the guys that, that uh, put us on the, on the levels that we are. Absolutely. Thank you. Once again, Lance Isaacs, if you, if you want to see what he's up to, you can go to his Athlete Facebook page. You can also go to lanceisaacs.com. Uh, Lancelot38.com. Lancelot38.com. Sir Lancelot, that is. Thanks, Lance.